Halo guys, welcome back to my channel. Kali ini gua akan share untuk football for life versi 2.0. Dan kemarin versi 1.8 itu improvementnya cuma sedikit doang. Jadi mungkin kalian kurang puas untuk improvementnya dan versi 2.0 ini ada perubahan sangat banyak sekali, guys. Di sini ada berapa poin? Ini ada 7 atau 8 poin gini untuk perubahannya versi 2.0 dan gua akan tes gua akan tes di PES eh football football lab 2024 yang kata di situ ya karena ini DT18 jadi kalian hapus dulu yang realistis kemarin yang di lab CBK dia menggunakan DT18 all CBK gitu guys. Nah, di sini ada penambahan di sini AI telah AI pemain telah ditingkatkan secara signifikan. Peningkatan tingkat CPU, CPU seharusnya tidak lagi menerima peningkatan berlebihan pada pertandingan tertentu. Peningkatan penandaan pemain bertahan secara signifikan ini juga akan sangat berarti bagi mereka yang bermain BAL atau Backup Legend karena permainan pemain bertahan akan mendapat nilai yang lebih baik. Oke, ini untuk Backup Legend juga bagus nih. Para pemain sekarang akan lebih terbuka meminta bola untuk dioper kepada mereka dan menciptakan peluang untuk mencetak gol. Jadi permainan uh, pemain dari tersebut itu dia saat membagi dia langsung terbuka dia tahu arahnya ke mana gitu guys. Nah terus mengubah banyak parameter yang terkait dengan mencetak gol. Header yang ditingkatkan secara signifikan, CPU sekarang juga akan memainkan satu dua lintasan. Peningkatan truck ball ini tidak lagi kasar dan tidak wajar. Peningkatan tembakan, kekuatan tembakannya tidak berubah tetapi ketinggian terbangnya telah dikurangi sedikit. Respon pemain terhadap perintah sedikit meningkat dibandingkan versi 1.8. Gameplay sekarang akan dimuat melalui file DT18. Nah, itu guys. Banyak perbaikan di balik layar yang akan membuat modding lebih lanjut, lebih mudah bagi saya yang tidak dapat Anda lihat. Oke lah guys, itu saja yang dari fitur tersebut di improvementnya oke sangat banyak sekali ini oke langsung aja kita lihat cus ke gameplaynya langsung ke gameplay very little at stake but then you consider a, a chance for one or two of the fringe players to get a look in and this becomes a big incentive it changes the dynamic so there's plenty at stake for them which will do no harm to the energy levels and the overall conviction and hopefully the style of contest there's the hit oh that is rather wayward well he did get himself into a good position something for him to cling to Diego Carlos. And it's been taken straight back. Interesting ball. Oh, that's a key interception. Again. Out to the left it goes. And it's Shaw. Shaw. Tries to get it clear. Tomadei. Well, he's felt that, hasn't he? Diogo Dallo got a long way forward to join the attack. That's a good run down the left. Swings it across. Baran tries to clear. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. He's there to clear it. Good defending. 
Blaming, albeit from an unexpected source. Yeah, listen, we often get critical of a, a forwards tackle, but that was squeaky clean. Oh, he's going to be disappointed with that. Looking for the runner. Gently done. He steps in, and that's the end of that. Yeah, Peter, just have a look at this and see how the strikers are, are drifting into wide positions now. And that's tactical, is it? It's not been forced on them. No, it's all related to the hope of creating space for midfield runners. Defending of the desperate variety. Oh, nice touch. Aimed in towards the centre. it up out wide oh that's neat Douglas Luis forwards and with intent and he goes cross field ah, he's had it taken off him looking for options for movement Moved on forwards, and that has left him in a heap. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. <laughs> Dina. Dr. Stuiz. And the ball's a good one here. Well, that's a foul, and the whistle's gone. And he has shown him a yellow card. Well, the players are making their point, but the ref clearly isn't interested. He's waved them all away. Well, it was deliberate, it was seen. He's got the goal! is better than what we've just seen. 